There are seven seals, and seven daughters of Median. Moses fled from the face of Pharaoh, and welled in the land of Midian, and he sat down by a well. Now the priest of Midian had seven daughters, and they came and drew water, and filled the troughs to water their father's flock. And the shepherds came and drove them away, but Moses stood up and helped them, and watered their flock. Seven cities and their people drank from the well of truth. God looked upon the children of Israel, and God had respect unto them. On the opening of the seventh seal, there will be silence in heaven about the space of half an hour. In the right hand of him that sits on the throne is a book written within and on the back side, sealed with seven seals. The Lord will restore sovereignty to the tribes of Native America, and will return their lands, with peace. He is Yahweh, Allah, the Most High. When Moses prayed for water for his people, he struck the rock. Thereupon twelve springs gushed out from it, and each tribe recognized its drinking place. This is April Shaltais, using the computer to generate this message. This is Rome, and they decided to put me down. My dogs were poisoned, two of my brothers and a niece are dead. There is a secret out there, that they don't want you to know. Hypnosis is being used against you daily, and a hypnotist can control you. They only need to grab a hold of you, and now they control you from a distance. They can even hold conversations with you on the astral plane, which some people call the realm of thought, or the spirit realm. The well-known science of the mind author Joseph Murphy calls it the subconscious mind. Stay away from astral plane conversations. God does not talk to you. He talked with Moses, and gave Moses his law. God does not have conversations with you all day. That's a human, pretending to be a deity, on the astral plane, but it's really a human, who can, and will, hurt you, who is evil enough to pretend to be God. These people are into genocide, and they are the same people who practice genocide against Jews, Africans, Muslims, Native Americans, Mexicans, and more. Don't have conversations on the astral plane, stay in God's word. The scriptures say, those who spend their wealth in the way of Allah, and then do not follow up what they spent with reminders of their generosity or with insults, will have their reward with their Lord. They have nothing to fear, nor shall they grieve. 